We all store our memories as mental images, which can be still pictures or movies. And as we bring those to mind, we may also hear sounds, recount conversations, have feelings, and even experience smells and taste. The way in which these mental images are coded is what gives meaning to us and can affect how strong the feelings are about a particular memory. Some memories will just seem to haunt us and we can't seem to shake the negative feelings from them. This can affect our ability to focus and also our quality of life. So what I'm going to do here is show you how to change the coding of your memories. So you never need to have a memory bother you again. Usually those memories that have a lot of feeling and meaning have a lot of emotion attached to them. When we think about those memories with a lot of feelings attached to them, the mental image is big and bright in front of us. It is brightly colored, sharply focused, and we're looking through our own eyes, as if experiencing it all again for the very first time. Knowing this, if we change the structure of the mental picture, then the meaning will also change. So we're going to do an exercise. If anyone has a fear of spiders or any other minor phobia, this is a great exercise for dealing with those. For everyone else, we're going to ask you in a moment to think of a memory that you have a mildly unpleasant feeling of, just unpleasant enough that you will know when it's gone. So here goes, everyone do this. Think of that memory with a mildly unpleasant feeling on it. As you think of that memory, do you have a mental picture? Now make that picture really, really small, the size of a postage stamp. Shrink it down, put a frame around it, push it away from you as far as you can. And imagine putting it down on the floor. Make it dark, make it black and white, make it blurred and put yourself in the picture. See yourself, the back of your head in the picture. Have you done that now? Good. Now, just notice how differently you feel about that old memory while you keep it just like that. 